Tonight the moon will be full here. I haven't much time. Mr. McDougal, will you stop gargling your throat? Hey, you'll have to get your dog away from the phone. I can't hear a word you're saying. Dracula was just a, a legendary character. He never existed. Count Dracula sleeps in this coffin, but rises every night at sunset. Chick is right. This is awful silly stuff. Dracula? You know that person you said that there's no such person? Yes. I think he's in there, in person. Dracula can change himself at will into a vampire bat flying about the countryside. Listen, Wilbur. I know there's no such a person as Dracula. You know there's no such a person as Dracula. But does Dracula know it? Frankenstein's monster. A scientist named Frankenstein made a monster by sewing together parts of old dead bodies. Frankenstein gave the monster eternal life by shooting it full of electricity. Now, who'd be silly enough to believe that? <laughs> <laughs> the monster must have no will of his own, no fiendish intellect to oppose his master. I saw what I saw when I saw. One of them was about eight foot tall, way up there. And he walked like this. And the other one, he went like this. And he kept getting closer and closer. He kept staring. Eye to eye. I followed Dracula all the way from Europe because I believe that he's going to try and revive the Frankenstein monster. We must find him and destroy him before he can do that. So soon the moon will rise. Years ago, I was bitten by a werewolf. Ever since when the full moon rises, I turn into a wolf myself. I came all the way from Europe because Dracula and the monster must be destroyed. Together, we must find them. Come on. Well, broom closet.
so much about you, I feel as if we have already met. Who? What we need today is young blood and brains. Oh, no, no. Please don't wear that. What's the matter? I know you think I'm crazy, but in a half an hour, the moon will rise and I'll turn into a wolf. You and 20 million other guys. I've been waiting, Master. Sandra. Sandra. I shall remove your brain and put it in his body. You're going to take my brain and put it in Junior's body? Yes. Ha-ha! <laughs> For a minute, I didn't know how you were going to do it. <gasps> Frankie, 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 I'm telling you, it's a bad deal. I've had this brain for 30 years and it hasn't worked right yet. Oh boy, am I glad to see you. What are you looking out the window for? Somebody else coming after me? Dracula, the Wolfman, and the Monster, there's nobody. <laughs> 